Several Minnesota athletes are preparing to leave for the summer games in Japan. Our Katie Steiner caught up with one of them this morning. We're here at Twin Cities Twisters with Olympian Grace McCallum. Grace, thank you so much for joining us today. So what is it like to be an Olympian? Um, it feels pretty surreal. I don't think it's really sunk in yet. And walk us through what happened at trials. So you got done with the competition and then you just had to sit there and wait for 30 minutes before you found out if you made the team. What was that like for you? Um, it was hard to sit there and wait for 30 minutes, but I just knew that I left it all out on the floor and it was in their hands. So whatever happened, happened. So you made the team. Now, what is training looking like for the next really six days before you head to Tokyo? Yeah, we're working really hard in the gym on everything, cleaning up things and trying some new things on bars and working the endurance on floor. So I'm really looking forward to these next couple weeks just training really hard in the gym. So what is your goal when you head to Tokyo and you are competing? What is that one thing that you are lo really looking to do? My goal is to um, get an individual medal, but we'll see. <laughs> And what has it been like to compete with Team USA and to wear, you know, USA on your chest there? It's been such an honor. I feel so blessed that I've been giving this opportunity because um, not a lot of people get that. So I think it's pretty cool. <laughs> You've talked before about how much your faith has grounded you. How much are you going to be leaning on that in Tokyo? A lot, especially because I'm by myself, like my family's not there. Normally I'll go to church um, before sometime well, sometime before the meet, and since I won't have that, I'll really be leaning on my faith there, and my dad is sending me with a couple prayers to say before um, each practice in the morning, so I think that'll be really helpful to just kind of keep me at peace and calm when I'm there. Awesome. Well, thank you so much, Grace, for joining us. We are going to be cheering you on, and coming up tomorrow morning, we are going to be talking with Suni Lee. And there's a send-off party happening Saturday afternoon at the Liney Lodge Bandshell at the State Fairgrounds.